The Duquesne Dukes continue to flex their football muscles this season as they rolled past the Riverview Raiders this week by a score of 42-0. So far, the Dukes are 6-0 this season, and there doesn't seem to be anyone that can stop this tough 7th and 8th grade team. Playing on their home turf, the Dukes jumped out to an early lead, outscoring the Raiders 24-0 in the first half. One of those TDs came at the hands of number three Dom Robinson, who ran with the ball for a 12-yard touchdown after a pass from quarterback Jaquan Davidson. Davidson, who racked up 50 yards rushing and 62 yards passing, said he really needed to be concerned about the Raiders' defense. I had to uh, read the defense and uh, make good plays. The Dukes kept rolling right through the second half as number 43, Davon Williams, rushed for a 42-yard touchdown and crushed the Raiders with 11 tackles. Not to be outdone, number 30, Dante Adams, had eight tackles along with three sacks, a forced fumble, and a fumble recovery. A whole bunch of tackles. A whole bunch of tackles. How many do you think? Eight, man. By the third quarter, it was clear that the Raiders simply could not recover from the Dukes' stinging offense, including D'Angelo Mitchell's 28-yard rushing touchdown and four defensive tackles. Head coach Whiteman said a healthy team and a strong week of practice contributed to the Dukes' win. We put a lot of hard work in preparation this week, making sure that thankfully we got all our players back healthfully this week and um, run through our playbook every day and stay true to our play calling and our quarterbacks and our players executed exactly like we taught them. So we were extremely happy. The Dukes played tough until the end, keeping the Raiders scoreless. So far this season, in combined points, the Dukes have severely outscored their opponents by a collective 170 to 6. Coach, uh, any uh, particular standout moments in this game that you might want to know? Uh, I want to make sure we credit our defense with playing extremely well today and putting a lot of points on our board and, and taking it easy on the offense for once. Next week, the Dukes travel to East Allegheny to take on the Wildcats at Logan Middle School in North Versailles. Let's go Dukes!